This realm is... I swear by my 
sword. Go as what? Strike a pub. Things are about to get dicey. Gotcha. Quietly now. Traveler, Paimon, you're here too? Yuffie, Shinobu! Here for some hot pot, huh? What's the occasion? No, it's nothing like that. Wanmin restaurants just closed for a couple of days. But it's nice to try somewhere different for a change. Su Arnyang's hot pot is pretty good, and you can't get it at Wanmin restaurant. Wanmin's closed? Why? What happened? Well, it was partly our fault. Recently, some old classmates from the Tongwen Academy got in touch and said they were organizing a get-together. Yenfei's the most senior among us, since she's the most qualified, so she got to pick the location. And she booked Wanmin restaurant. The turnout was a lot higher than expected, and in the space of two days, we somehow got through all of the restaurant's stock for the week ahead. <sighs> Boss's enormous appetite was also a significant contributing factor. He went a little crazy. Chef Mao was pretty wiped out by the end, but he had a huge smile on his face. It was the best business he's had in months. The only thing is, it'll take him at least a couple days to fully restock. Bull Checker's here, too? Oh, Paimon's surprised we haven't seen him. Those horns stick out like two sore thumbs. Yeah, when he heard I was meeting up with some old classmates, he got very excited and decided he was coming with me. His logic was, and I quote, any classmate of Shinobu's is a classmate of mine. 
Notwithstanding the fact that Boss has never studied a day in his life, I think he just feels that he didn't get enough chances to indulge his taste buds last time he was in Liyue. That other kid you guys brought with you, though, what was his name again? Oh yeah, Grandmaster Hanakado. He seems like a smart cookie. You probably didn't notice because you were busy chatting to your classmates at the time, but he was helping Chef Mao out in the kitchen, uh, trying to pick up some uh, Liyue cooking skills. I suspect he just wanted to learn how to make some new dishes to feed to his own Ikabuto and make them stronger. Grandmaster Hanakado? Uh, where do we know that name from? Oh, yeah! Didn't we meet him during that beetle battle thing that Bullchucker organized that one time? That's right. Good memory, Paimon. After the near catastrophe that was the beetle brawl, Hanakado became an ally of the Arataki gang. He and Boss regularly hang out to have practice matches and discuss Onikabuto rearing strategies. But to his credit, a lot of the things he ropes Boss into doing in the name of beetle brawling actually result in Boss doing some real work for a change. It's made things a lot easier for me. For instance, they've decided to spend a few days helping Chef Mao restock the kitchen. Partly to thank him for the epic feast and partly because they would like to use the opportunity to look for new ingredients to boost their Onikabuto's performance. I think they're out looking for crabs at Guyun Stone Forest right now, with Miss Shangling and Mr. Guoba. They all seem to get along great. Guoba's already made friends with Crimson Staff, as Ito calls it, and, uh, something something Beetle King, or whatever Hanakado's is called. They've been out for quite a while, though. Shouldn't they be back by now? Unless something put them in a playful mood. In which case, it's anyone's guess what kind of mess they might be in by now. Well, now Paimon wants to join in the fun! Crabs from Glee and Stone Forest? Mmm, Paimon bets they taste great! Why don't we go see if they need our help? The sooner one main restaurant is fully stocked, the sooner we get to eat there again! And while we're at it, we can see what Bullchucker and Grandmaster Hanakado are really up to over there. So you two are gonna head over? I think that's a great idea! The Traveler, Paimon, and Ito make a good team. Not everyone can get through to him, but he usually listens to you two. You make a good point. Well, thanks for checking up on them, you two. Ugh, I'm suddenly feeling a bit warm. Maybe I've been eating too much spicy food lately? Oh no, you poor thing! It could be a fever, or maybe the humidity's making you overheat. Wait here, I'll go get you some iced tea. Add Astra. <laughs> 